What is up killers, Kev here and today back with a brand new episode of 5 new console mods to be hitting the Bethesda on our website this week. This is episode 481 within my series but without further ado guys, let's just jump straight into the video. White Run River Trees coming in at 49.6 kilobytes of our download. This adds several trees to the river just outside of White Run. Performance friendly with no FPS drops personally myself and within the claims within the description too. And the mod also wanted to expand the outer area of White Run with a little bit of foliage to make it seem a little less empty and lifeless. That is for sure. This mod definitely aims to fix that 110 percent obviously we've got similar mods like this on the xbox one and obviously pc but we don't have anything that fills the foliage outside of settlements and this one is for white run hopefully we can see many more of these in the future Dreddick armor set and weapons coming in at a big download size of 146.3 megabytes of a download. I just want to say before we jump into this showcase that this armor when recorded didn't actually have any boots but you should have now as it has recently been updated for version 2 to fix the boots so you will have fully fleshed boots as well. For this particular one head over to the forge and create this one or if you're lazy like me head over to the location on screen now which is in the watchtower just outside the the castle and you can pretty much have everything there all of it should be there including the boots obviously via this video that you're seeing right now on screen it does not have the boots but guys the model meshes and textures of this one are absolutely gorgeous many different variations of helmets as well can be replaced within this particular mod open or closed and loads of other different accessories and other features that you can click and click out so a plug-in feature to do with this set pretty much pick and choose what you like overall i really do like this armor set it's absolutely clean very law friendly indeed personally let me know your thoughts of this particular armor down within the comment section below Imperial Agent 1992's additional face presets coming in at 297.5 kilobytes of a download adds custom made presets for both male and female and all races included too. Not too sure of the number of presets that have been added within this particular mod but an absolute brilliant one to be added into the game. We do see a lot of other different features such as skin texture mods, other than things such as hair, eyebrows, eyeballs loads of other different things like that but presets as a whole we are not going to be seeing those and thankfully we have seen them this week this is going to be on all platforms this particular mod YY Mystical Night Animations coming in at 2.5 megabytes of a download. The unmodified YY Mystical Night Animation pack with draw and sheath included within this particular one. This is going to be a beautiful port from the NexusMods.com, ported for us on the Bethesda Night website for Skyrim Special Edition. This one is going to be changing an awful lot of animations. If you can't see this particular sort of what it changes within the video on screen now, I do believe there's many other videos lurking around there's also a few different screenshots on the Bethesda on a website that do sort of do a comparison between the vanilla and this particular mod I really do enjoy this one if you are playing a battle mage or primarily a mage within the game I'd 110% grab this particular one but if you're looking for more of a warrior theme I wouldn't choose this one there are many other different ones out there not only to do with YY but other different mods out there too let me know guys if you want to see a mini mod showcase on something like this and break it down for everything that you do get within a particular animation pack like this as well let me know down in the comment section below and i'm pretty sure i'll get around to it at some stage or other we've got a lot coming on the channel very soon so if you haven't already make sure to click that subscribe button white run farm home coming in at 17.2 megabytes of a download the farm home has been added right next to the stables within white run for this particular one you can find a selection of goodies within the home itself and outside of the home too riverwood now has an enchantment table in the sleeping giants inn and a bunch of other different things have been scattered around the world i won't give too much away but if you want to check it out yourself as obviously as i recommend in every video grab the module yourself and try out have a little look at the description on the Bethesda on our website I'm not going to give too much away but this particular mod is very nice indeed not only for the player home that you see on screen now too but you get a bunch of other different stuff lurking and added in it to your base game 
So guys, that's the end of this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, I would very much appreciate a like on the video. It does help me out an awful lot. If you're new around it too, click that subscribe button. It's completely free. And if you want to go above and beyond to help me out even further, click that little bell. That will give you a notification for every single time I post a video like this to the channel. But guys, until the next one, Killer Kev here and Killer Kev out.